All right, guys, I got exciting news. Let me get you caught up to speed and tell you what's going on. So the other night I was in town bowling. It was a Tuesday night, so I do on Tuesday nights, and Jenna calls me. She says, we have a mystery package at the house, and it's addressed to Captain Croc. <laughs> so and they come with very strict instructions that when I opened it, I had to be videoed. I was excited and terrified all at the same time. So I rushed home, couldn't wait to see what it is, rushed home, and uh, here's the video of unpacking. What's up, friends? <laughs> In the YouTube world. Hey, so, Mr. Dirt Perfect himself. Hey, I gotta record this too because of the delivery. I am worried. Okay, look at me. Mr. Dirt Perfect yes. received a package in the mail today but addressed. Who? Hold on. We're going to find out real quick who it's from there, dear. It's addressed to Captain Croc. So, let's all take a moment and think about who that might be from. Uh, it's uh, pretty much one person. Okay. And that's why it worries me what might be in this thing because we have instructions. Hey, look over here and say that to him because he's getting this video right here. Because we have instructions to open this up on camera. Yeah, he told me to I swear, if a crocodile comes out of this thing, I'm going to have your butt. <laughs> okay, the suspense is killing us all. I'm afraid to open it. Something's going to pop out of this thing. Open. You open it. You're more disposable no, than me. It's Address to Captain Croc. I am not Captain Croc. I am Mrs. Oh, Dirt Perfect. There is a difference. I'm worried about this. I'm not going to lie. Okay, I got to come right. on this angle. What do you think it is? I don't know. It's let's Jason take, works a lot. I know. So, I'm not sure. so let's take bets. OMG. You want to know what my bet is? What? I'm guessing it's a. Uh, how you say that thing? Flu Flay? Flu Flay Fryer Flangy? Yeah, that's it. You got it What's right. it called? I don't know what it's called. That cool souffle. contraption. Souffle. Souffle? I'm gonna, cool go with the, I'm gonna go with the souffle, and I think he probably broke down and went to Team Croc, and he was gonna be a pair of Crocs in here that's gonna be matching to his. <laughs> Why would he want to match Crocs with you? Because I'm the cool kid on the block, okay. and he wants to match me. Okay, let's I'm stalling because I know something's gonna jump out of this package. Open. Something's gonna pop out of there. Open the box. Let him get close? Yes. Have you met the guy? Yes. Something's gonna pop out of here, I'm telling you. Open a box. Okay, I'm moving nice. to this location. Yeah, you're getting in the way. No, because I want to see your face when you open it. I swear, something pops out of this box. If it's alive. You ready? Yeah. Uh, nothing yet. See a box. All right, still alive. O M G. Well, open that darn thing. What is it? There's no way. No freaking way. What is it? Have you lost your freaking mind? Hey, look over here. I think he's lost his mind. What is it, a drone? Holy crikey balls. I ain't a genius, but I think this is a freaking drone. Jason, I'm speechless, and that's quite the accomplishment. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Look at that! Look at that! It's not a crocodile. I'm so excited. It's Why a drone. in the world do you deserve that? I don't know. There's got to be a catch. Dude. All right, see y'all later. I'm gonna go fly this thing, bye. I know, absolute, utter disbelief. Look at this guy. He's so freaking cool. He's so cute, he's so awesome. I gotta nickname him. Like the way he nicknames all this stuff is like little mosquito or pissed off something. I don't know. Anyways, it's awesome. So <clears throat> that begs the question, who sent it? Where'd it come from? I don't know, but I think it has something to do with this guy. I cannot get him to admit it, but he's involved some way, shape, or form. So, thank you, Jason. I know it was you that did it. I'm doing this video anyways, whether it was you or not, you're getting credit for it, because it was you. If it's somebody else, let me know, but I'm pretty sure it was Jason. That's beside the point, I got a drone.
Look at it. It's awesome. It's so freaking awesome. So, um, I'm done talking to you guys. I've been flying this thing. I got a little bit of video and some stuff. So I'm gonna do a little collage, throw together bullcrap stuffy. And uh, you can see what I've done. But long story short, we are gonna have some awesome videos because I got a drone. All right, guys, here it is, maiden voyage. First thing I did was flew it around the house here, got a few pictures of the house. Obviously you can see, I'm still trying to learn a little bit because I missed out. Went down to Derby. Uh, I've always been wanting to get a few pictures of the Derby Community Center. This is the uh, community center the Derby Community Association has here, weddings, uh, baby showers, whatever your events are. Anyways, I just thought it'd be cool to fly up and get a few. So then I decided to go over to camp. I had to load the dozer up and I was going to try out the active track mode. This thing is bad. Beep, 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 beep. You know what? So I locked this thing on the dozer. Take off in the semi. And I'm like, there is no way in heck this drone's going to follow me down the road. And let me tell you, this booger was doing good until I just about flew it right into the power line. But the good news is this thing's smarter than I am. So it, uh, it avoided the power line itself. No issues. Man. Just think about all the cool shots I'm going to be able to get for you guys come this summer. I am so dang excited about this thing. It's just, uh, it's just awesome. I'm just now starting to learn how to use it. I mean, this thing's got so many features and options on it. I'm not sure if I'm ever going to use any of them, but I'm going to try to figure them out one by one at a time. I am so, if I mentioned I'm excited about this thing. So went up to the house and uh, had to load both track hose on the trailer. And I didn't quite get centered. I got some work to do here. I tried to center myself up, but... I just thought this was kind of a little bit of a cool flyover. Uh, the the trailer loaded, uh, both track hose sitting on it. Um, I don't know. I thought it was cool. I was just kind of playing with it. Excuse to fly. We'll go with that. So then this shot here, I just kind of took off over top of it, and then I don't know. I think I was six, seven hundred feet in the air by the time I stopped. But uh, the end of this shot here, after I get a good ways up, there's the 850 there. You can see the loader sitting there. This is on the hill uh, right above my house, and I pan out here in a minute. Uh, you'll see my house, my brother's house, and then uh, off in the distance, you will see the river. Oh, I mentioned I'm excited. This thing's so dang cool. I just The possibilities are absolutely endless, I say. All right, guys, if you can't tell, I am pretty darn excited about this thing. Jason, thank you so much for the drone you didn't have to do that i will get you back i will make this right we will get even he also got me this cool hat this thing's gonna get wore out the nose won't stay white because i love it it's absolutely awesome a couple other things real quick before i get off of here um those of you guys know that officer hoover uh dot officer a uh, good friend of mine he's also he's also got what they call a dot bear woodworks i think it is check out this bad beep 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 i'm doing a lot of beeping tonight ain't I? this bad sign he made me ain't that thing cool i gotta find a place to hang it up here that is awesome thank you so much you guys get a chance get on facebook check out dot bear woodworking he's got a lot of cool stuff on there he's made beds and shoe racks and he also made uh, boxes for his scales in his truck so he's an organized dot officer but I gotta get that thing hung up, but thank you so much, Hoover, man. Good friend, great guy, great DOT officer. Can't say enough kind things about him. The channel has absolutely blown up the last week. I think I've got more subscribers in the last week than I did in the first four months. And guys, I'm amazed. You guys are amazing. I got some amazing sus subscribers. It's a hard word to say. Uh, I can't thank you enough, guys enough. Thanks for all the comments. Your comments are awesome. I love the feedback. If there's something you want to see more of, something you want to see less of, something you want me to elaborate on, drop a comment down below. Let me know. Steer this channel whichever way you guys want to go. I'm open as you can... What in the world? Sorry, sidetrack. I'm open. As you guys can tell, I cover quite the wide range of things. So uh, let me know if there's something you want to go. So uh, before I go... Check it out, uh, Dirt.Perfect Instagram, Dirt.Perfect Facebook, Dirt.Perfect1.com. We'll be up soon. we got stickers in. We're working on some apparel stuff. Uh, things are crazy. Yeah, it's wild. So hit the subscribe button. Hit the thumbs up. Tap the bell so you know will be the first one to see what comes up next. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.